This is a fairly straightforward word question. There's no numbers, there's no calculations. We're going to read the question and go through the choices to determine which of these choices is the best choice for this question. So here's our question. Accounting controls are concerned with the safeguarding of assets and the reliability of financial records. Consequently, these controls are designed to provide reasonable assurance that all of the following take place except. Okay, we've got two key words that we need to recognize in order to get this question correct. The first key word is, we're talking about accounting controls. Okay, there's all kinds of controls in the company. We're interested in accounting controls. And what we're supposed to see here is, accounting controls provide reasonable assurance that all of the following take place except. So three of these are things that accounting controls are used for, and one of them is not. So choice A, permitting access to assets in accordance with management's authorization. Well, access to assets, well, they say safeguarding of assets in the question up here. So that certainly looks like something that accounting controls do. So that is not the correct answer. Choice B, executing transactions in accordance with management's general or specific authorization. Well, executing transactions, that's really what it is that accounting does. Choice C, compliance with methods and procedures ensuring operational efficiency and adherence to managerial policies. Well, controls certainly do this. The question is whether or not these are accounting controls that will do that. When we talk about operational efficiency, adherence to managerial policies, are those accounting controls that we're going to be using for that? So, choice C, we'll put a question mark here, maybe that's it. Let's look at choice D, comparing recorded assets with existing assets at periodic intervals and taking appropriate action with respect to differences. That is very clearly part of safeguarding of assets and making certain that those assets are protected. And so choice C, as we kind of suspected, is our correct answer. There are certainly controls to do this, but once we've identified that we're talking about accounting controls, Choice C becomes the correct answer because though there are controls to do that, they are not accounting controls that are going to be doing that.